Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in once again. What you see in front of you is US patent number 6,810,616. It's an international patent pending made in Israel product called the Lula, made by Maglula. It's a loader unloader for the mag you see in front of you, which happens to be a stoner ASC 9mm NATO SMG mag Colt pattern. If you've ever fondled or used one of these mags, you know it's a real pain in the butt to put 32 bullets in it. Well, it's not all that hard to unload, but it's real, real major pain in the butt to load. So, I stumbled upon this little gem. Sounded good. I've used other Maglula products. Figured I'd give it a try. 30 bucks down the drain if it's no good. I've blown 30 bucks on a lot worse things. So, um, I'll be honest with you, my wife has always accused me of being easily amused, and I won't argue with her. She's right, I am. But, in my eager to be easily amused persona, whatever, I uh, opened this up, and without looking at the directions, tried to use it. Couldn't figure out how to unload the mag with it. Looked at the instructions. It didn't quite sink in. I hate to call myself out on my own stupidity, but nonetheless, there it was. In all honesty, I'm probably not the only person who's had that brain fart. So I went to YouTube, and I found one video by Maglula themselves showing this particular product in operation. And uh, even then... It was right in front of my face, but I didn't understand it. So, enough of that. Let me tell you what the deal is. It's plastic polymer resin. Check it out at maglula.com. There's their website and their name. This is the locking tab. This is your little key ring, so you could put it on your keys or chain it together with all your other Maglula products or range products, whatever. Here's your mag. This is the mag catch. You want to line those up. You hear that click? It locks on. Unlike a lot of their other loader unloaders, this one physically locks onto the mag. Listen again. And of course it doesn't click that time. <laughs> okay, anyway. So, this lever has a set of cams on it. That, if you're familiar with a car's camshaft, look exactly like that. And as you rock it back and forth, you can see the cam in there functioning. Drop your bullet in, flip it, so forth. But I couldn't figure out why it wasn't kicking the bullet out. Why aren't you coming out, bullet? Look, look. Oh, hold on. This is, this is where your friend gravity comes into play. Wait for it. Gravity again. Gravity again. That one was a little stubborn. Gravity is your friend, folks. Don't deny it. The trick is not to hold it sideways. Certainly not to hold it straight up. Don't even hold it upside down. Hold it. Bullet tip. You see the tip of the bullet down, and then babies fall right out. Have you a little bucket or cloth or something to catch them on, and you start dropping them on your tile, your wife's going to get pissed, or hell, you may be pissed yourself. But anyway, so how does it load, you're asking? Well, <laughs> exact opposite. Let gravity do the work for you. Flip it. Flip it. Flip it. All right, you can see the cam in there. It's the shiny thing. It's actually metal. While the body of this is this polymer resin, this arm is plastic coated metal. You can feel it's got some weight to it and you can clearly see it right there. But when you flip this, it literally pushes the bullet down. You see my opening, the bullet just falls in. There's the other cam on that shaft I was talking about. It just rolls right over the bullet, pushing it down making way for the next one to just fall right in. 
same thing cams it down opens a spot for the next one cams it down opens a spot for this one cams it down everything's in there lift up on your mag lock you got yourself a fully loaded mag and you didn't have to break your little thumbs and you got to play with gravity without hurting yourself hopefully anyway that's literally <laughs> how you use this thing explained as straight forth and as simply as I could possibly fathom it and when you're done slide that down throw it in your pocket your range bag whatever and off you go anyway if you've got something that uses these mags and there's a lot of guns out there that do buy you one of these you'll thank me I promise thanks for watching everybody this is Scipio 2 y'all have yourselves a good one take care